You would have been forgiven if you had thought that Kanu was having its National Delegates Conference at the Nyayo National Stadium on Tuesday. But the hundreds who made their way here, some as early as 5.30 in the morning, did not come to mourn. They were here to celebrate the life of a man who was instrumental in their upbringing. Under the smoldering heat of the sun, they made their way inside a stadium Mzemoi built 37 years ago and one that would now be the venue of his final journey. All the decisions. He blended in well, remaining patent in the midst of this crowd, yet conspicuous enough to draw attention to himself. As many silently read the late Moi's eulogy, Noah Kihara, a political satirist, was living his childhood dream, imitating the late president right down to the gap between his teeth. And Noah was not alone. Many Moi satirists were all over town, honoring their hero the best way they knew how. But for those whose comedic bones were not so vibrant, fashion was their statement of intent. Uh, four, Anthony Maingi dressed to impress. Loaded with a Kanu briefcase, he sang along with the crowd witnessing history up close while drawing attention using his unique attire. Nikona tatu. Anthony's tie, a mirror similar to one Mzemo used to adorn back in the day. And he was not the only one. From as early as 6.30 in the morning, Kenyans had already begun flocking here at the Nyayo National Stadium to issue their final respects to the longest serving head of state in this republic. And from the sea of humanity, it wasn't hard to notice those who decided to pay their last respects with a little bit of flair. People like this gentleman who is adorned with the Kenyan flag, and we'll see if we can be able to talk to him. Paul Maina hails from Gatanga constituency in Muranga County, but came here to witness history. He patiently sat and listened to speeches having arrived at the stadium at 6 a.m. Mimi saingine stakangi kuambiwa, nataka kujionea. TV onilikuja hapa, hili nijione, natue na ibada ya kupumzisa, huyu uka moi. Accompanied by a replica of an old Nyayo era goodie, Paul joined men, women, the young and the old, who had come out in numbers to give their final goodbye to the professor of politics in the only way they knew best. Timothy Utieno, KTN News.